My name is John Dickinson, and I'm the general manager of Ideal Dairy. Back around the turn of the century, uh, 1900, my great-great-grandfather bought 14 cows and started selling milk door to door. Uh, but since then, we were just selling it strictly wholesale by the trailer load. No matter how the size of the farm is, it still is a family-run business. We are very fortunate to have three of the younger generation that's interested in dairying. We're just really glad to have someone to pass the dairy on to. My favorite cow on the farm is Baby Book. She's a six-year-old cow that's going to have her fourth calf January 17th. She is just, to me, a beautiful and highly productive cow. She's uh, classified Excellent 94. So we like to see some experience when we're hiring um, herd staff to work with our animals. Their, their care is extremely important to us. So we like to see somebody that has had experience in a similar position on a similar farm. So we like to know that they're going to take care of the animals and, and put in the time. Mostly just emphasize the care that our animals require. My name is Heidi Matthews and I'm the calf manager at Ideal Dairy. In the winter we put the calves in calf blankets after their mothers dry them off. Keeps them warm. It's kind of like the equivalent of a human having a jacket put on them just keeps them warm and when they get too big we take them out. So we have the Laley automatic feeders. We have two individual stalls. They feed 12 liters per day. It's about five visits that they can do. I think the most rewarding part of managing and working with the calves here at Ideal Dairy is watching them when they become cows and kind of seeing the progress that they made and how much they grow and the potential that they have. Uh, it's pretty rewarding to know I'm doing my job. We work very closely with uh, two nutritionists on the farm and they are here at least once a week, sometimes twice, walking through the cows, making changes and adjustments, looking at the uh, health and productivity of the cows and we're, we're always trying to strive to do what's best for the cows and best for the farm. We have super ventilation, we've invested a lot of money in fans, soakers uh, to keep cows cool in the summertime, deep sand beds that are groomed on a daily basis to make sure that cows have a clean dry bed to lay in. We have cow brushes to help keep cows clean. It makes everybody's life easier when everybody's committed to a common goal and making sure that cows are cared for properly and it's our a number one goal to make sure that cows are well taken care of and I mean that's the heartbeat of our business is the cows. Probably the most rewarding part of being a dairy farmer for me is I enjoy working with cattle, I enjoy working outside, and I enjoy working with my family. I don't know as I can quantify which is higher value than the other. Mm -hmm.